again, Governor, and uh, I think it's my turn to uh, make some uh, closing uh, remarks. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much, Manuel. Again. Okay. So uh, let me first uh, tell you that uh, it has been a pleasure to count with your uh, participation in this conference. Um, I think we have had a fruitful discussion um, to exchange views and practices of the incorporation of big data to the production of official statistics. Um, let, me, let me first try to summarize very briefly uh, the, the, the main contributions I believe they have made done during this, uh, this day uh, before concluding the, the conference. Um, firstly, we have had the pleasure to come with the State Secretary for the uh, opening session of this conference. She has uh, highlighted that INE fulfills the important mission of providing high-quality statistics to users for decision-making. Um, secondly, the Director General of Eurostat has stressed that we must anticipate the future because the challenges are tremendous and the speed of changes are so fast that we have to be prepared to face them. She has underlined also that the challenge is to use private data and turn them into raw material to produce statistics. For this purpose, it's, it is key accelerating the dialogue with private data holders. Furthermore, she has underlined the strength of the European statistical system as a partnership for the exchange of best practices. During the panel discussions, the Director General of Vine Portugal, INSE France and, and myself, we, we have exposed our view on the need to continue producing statistics of the higher quality to meet the needs of a data science society. The President of INE Portugal has stressed the role of the producers of official statistics in the new society, who face the challenge of meeting the new demands respecting the principle established in the European Statistics Code of Practice. In order to respond to the new demands, in terms of timeliness, relevance, and granularity, INE Portugal has decided the creation of a national data infrastructure that integrates data from companies, individuals, and households concluding that one of the largest challenges of the official statistics is to cover and cover, but maintaining the high quality standards we are having now. On his side, the Director General of INSEE has stated that official statistics not only face the challenge of having access to new data sources, but also of responding to the measurement of new phenomena that appear in the era of digitalization. To this end, he has pointed out the importance of achieving greater and better access to existing administrative records. Another important challenge for official statistics is to promote and improve a statistical curtail at all levels, including effective communication and information to citizens, as well as increasing access to data for research. Finally, the governor of the Bank of Spain has commented that nowadays all our decisions are reflected in the database, whose content has been multiplied exponentially. However, at the same time, the knowledge of reality has not, been, has not increased in the same proportion, because data is not structured or precisely defined. For these reasons, are for this reason, he mentioned, statistics are so important, and in particular, official statistics, since it is what converts data into authentic information, which is vital to have an adequate perspective of reality and to be able to make good decisions. In this ta task, he has also mentioned that Bank of Spain and the INE complement each other especially. The first provides the financial dimension and the second includes 
the consumption and investment decisions of the agents through the national accounts. In the effort to analyze reality and to evaluate public policies, it's also necessary to count on the research community. In this sense, the data laboratory of the Bank of Spain is a good initiative. I'm very grateful for the high attendance to the conference and for the interest and active participation of all attendees. I hope you have enjoyed with the speech of the panelists and it's useful for your daily works in the current that the fight world. I formally declare the first edition of the conference on statistics for declare, I'm sorry, I formally declare closed the first edition of the Conference on Statistics for Society. Thank you very much to all of you. And hope to see you in the next conference, probably in, the, in better conditions. Thank you very much.